Everything on Coruscant is huge. You see those city towers as we flew in? How many people you figure live in those? Millions? Looks like some of the city towers lost a few levels. Heard the Sith Empire hit this planet pretty hard. Even knocked the Jedi Temple off its pedestal. Wanna find Skalvik before we're too old to shoot straight? We're gonna need local help. We'll just rattle some skulls until Skalvik falls out. Wouldn't mind getting some practice with Sparky here, but... I know a faster way. There's a gambler named Darmus Polarin who keeps tabs on everything worth knowing about Coruscant. Good man. You'll like him. Worth a visit, I guess. Where do I find this Darmus? Bidu always said if you look for a sabacc table surrounded by beautiful women, you'll find Darmus. But I can narrow that down. I still have Vidu's hollow frequency contacts, and Darmus is one of them. Give me a second, and we'll talk to the man himself. Corso, is that you? It's been too long, you rascal. What brings you to Coruscant? A friend and I are in a real bind. Is there a place we can meet you? Of course. Come to my private cantina booth. I'm here now, winning my tenth hand of Sabacc against a very persistent rhodium. Hope you don't mind the occasional blaster fire. The cantina is in a rowdy part of Coruscant. I just came from a war zone. I'm used to blaster fire. I had a feeling you were more than a tourist. Keep your comlink channel open, Darmus. I've got some bad news about Vidu. I'll bring Darmus up to speed while we travel, Captain. Don't tell Darmus anything he doesn't need to know. You got it. Welcome, my friend. I'm Darmus Polarin, a back player and information resource without equal. Nice to meet you. I'm the fastest blaster in the galaxy. I guess congratulations are in order. I wasn't aware that competition had been settled. Good for you. Sorry to hear about Vidu. He was a man of refined taste and a terrible card player. I'll truly miss him. Life is like Sabacc. The trick is to quit while you're ahead and enjoy your winnings. Exactly how I'll spend my twilight years. Looks to me like you're already in your twilight years. Really? Good thing I'm having such a wonderful time, then. Now, I know this isn't a social call. Corso says you have troubles, and I'm prepared to help. A man named Skavik stole my freighter and brought it here. Corso mentioned a cargo hold full of stolen blasters. And the infamous Rogan the Butcher, too. My sympathies. Skavik is well known in the galactic underworld. He's earned death sentences across the galaxy for everything from armed robbery to kidnapping. He's known to be in the Sith Empire's pocket. And he even cheats at cards. I'm happy to help you find him. But there's one thing I hate. It's a card cheat. In my book, if you can only win by cheating, you shouldn't be playing the game at all. Soon as Corso mentioned Skavik's name, I alerted all my best informants. I'm getting some interesting leads. What did I tell you, Captain? Darmus can find out anything. We'll have Skavik in no time. Vidu said the same thing. And look what happened to him. Vidu, good as he was, lacked my particular gift for conversation. Not to mention my vast network of contacts. Skavik recently used the services of a data slicer named Kixie in the Migrant Merchants Guild headquarters. Quite talented, I hear. I'll say this. The man has a way with women. I don't think it's a romantic relationship. Skavik doesn't convert with aliens. 
even near humans like Kixie. Kixie might be able to help you flush Skavik out of hiding. Be careful, though. The guild is well-armed and doesn't like outsiders. Excuse me, but I noticed some delightful young ladies in desperate need of attention. Duty calls. Wish I had a couple dozen thermal detonators right now. There's bound to be somebody around here with a clearance pass. You ready for some more action, Captain? Open up, you stupid door. I've been monitoring you on the security network. You sure know how to make an entrance. Guess we found our slicer. But why does this room look like a prison? Because it is a prison. Thanks for noticing. Whatever issues you're having with the guild, I'm on your side. I'm just a slave here. You don't look like a slave to me. If I try to leave this room, they'll shoot me. Does that sound free to you? The guild locked me up two years ago. Forced me to work for them. I'll do anything to get out. What do you need? We'll be on Skavik's trail and I'll free you. Finding his trail is easy. Just look for the slime. I knew that Corellian pig lizard Skavik had ticked off the wrong person. No wonder he was in such a hurry. Skavik paid the guild to clean his identity record. They made me slice into the Republic's main database and delete all his arrest warrants. Knowing Skavik. You spent a lot of time deleting things. It's like he's trying to set a record for the biggest criminal of all time. Sorry, but that's all I know about Skavik. I'm not sure how else to help you. Isn't there some way to figure out where Skavik is? Do you know how many people are on Coruscant? It takes a lot for one man to stand out. Hang on. Maybe that's it. Take away his spotless identity record, and Skavik can't walk ten meters without attracting attention. It'll be a lot easier to find. I can ruin Skavik's identity record for you in no time. If I do that, will you let me go? Show me what you can do to him first. I've been slicing the Republic's main databank for years. There's nothing I can't do. I saved copies of everything I erased from Skavik's identity record. All I have to do now is transfer the data back. There. Easy. The minute he passes an identity checkpoint, it'll trigger an alarm. What else can you do to Skavik's identity record? Depends on how much damage you're looking to inflict. Make it so no woman in the galaxy will ever touch him again. I'll register him as a plague carrier. Give him a nice case of Both and Nether Rot. That'll keep the girls away. Okay, let me go now so I can make it out before they lock this place down. I was always planning to let you go. Thank you, you're my hero. Maybe we should go check in with Darmus, see if he's got any new info on Skavik. An informant spotted you leaving the Migrant Merchants Guild. I trust Kixie was useful? Kixie did a real number on Skavik's identity record. On a world this crowded with people and technology, he can't hide for long. My sources reveal Skavik is doing business with the Black Sun Gang. A dangerous friendship for all sorts of reasons. Black Sun is notorious for keeping holo recordings of all their meetings. No doubt they preserve the highlights of Skavik's visit. I doubt Black Sun just lets anybody peek at their hollows. Black Sun fragments its recordings over several computers to prevent unauthorized viewing. You'll have to assemble the relevant footage by accessing each computer. I should warn you, Black Sun controls an entire sector of Coruscant. They're thugs with the most horrible manners. Do be careful. Good luck. Well, well. The Jackal of the Stars himself pays me a visit. Long time no see, Skavik. You must really need my help, huh? Urbax, buddy, you're such a cynical guy. Can't I just be paying an old friend a visit? You and friends is the funniest thing I've heard all year. Get to the point before I stop laughing. A long man from the outer rim is sticking to me like a Marnock on a power coupling. I need somebody to scrape him off. Lawman, huh? Sounds like that'll cost you double. Whatever it takes. Look, I'm in a rush to wrap up with the business here. Besides, finding work for my friends makes me feel good. Nice. So where is this little parasite you want me to remove? He's at a docking bay in the spaceport, and he's alone. I'm sure he won't give a burly scrapper like you much trouble. I guarantee he won't. Oh, and I'll be wanting my payment in advance. 
wouldn't have it any other way, Urbax. You enjoy yourself. It might be this lawman knows how to find Skalik. We'd better try to save him. Let's go bust up that party at the spaceport, Captain. This was fun, little mouse. But we're done playing. Time to die. I can't figure out if this Sullustin's deaf or just stupid. All of you against one guy? That's overkill, don't you think? I told you idiots to watch that door. Do I have to do everything myself? This is none of your business, scum. Get out while you still can. I'm sure if we ask them real nicely, they'll just leave. You heard the man, lawbreakers. Surrender now, or else. You really are as dumb as you look, aren't you? Kill them both, men. Sticking up for the little guy is what I do best. I'm just a simple starship captain trying to earn a living. I'm hunting Skavik too. He stole my starship. I'll take any help I can get. Knock yourself out. Ni unka waza uba foi da queen yo yafa de ia. Nego ejin baja ta ko poeta sawata, queen moya ka ume boije. Let's not be here when the local security shows up. We don't have time to answer questions. Maybe we should go see if Darmus knows anything new about Skavik. See? what I tell ya? It's the captain from Rogue on the Butcher's bounty posting. Are we lucky or what? I never doubted you for a second, lover. You've always been my lucky star. Ugh, you two make me sick. Hold it right there, Captain! Is that a hairstyle, or did a womp rat die in your head? Did you just... What did... Who do you... Shut up! Come on, you two. Let's cremate this fool and get rich. You kids run home to your mamas before I spank you. All right, that's it. Let's roast this stupid nerf herder. He's off, Scorch. I have a bad feeling about this captain. Looks like more than we can handle. Not man enough for a real challenge? Don't know what you see in this guy, Igara. More than you could ever show me. Rilo, this bounty's worth more money than we could earn in a month. All right, lover, but stay behind me. I don't want you getting hurt over a lousy stack of credits. Listen to me, I'm, I'm not who you think I am. Oh, please, that's what they all say. The real villain here is a man called Skavik. Never heard of him. You're just stalling. Wait a minute. That name sounds familiar. Skavik's worth more dead than alive, Rilo. Last time I checked his bounty, it was huge. How huge? Buy a starship and retire huge. Skavik is somewhere here on course. Track him down. Good tip. So when we're done collecting on you, maybe we'll go after him too. Let's burn it up! Woo! <laughs> I mean, 
some trouble with bounty hunters, Captain? Got anything for me about Skavik? He's still hiding beneath whatever rock he crawled under. But I expect that will change soon. I hear Black Sun's on an emergency recruitment drive, and you had an altercation at the spaceport. I take it my lead was worthwhile. Turns out, there's a Celestin Laman chasing Skavik too. It's always good to have friends with common interests. While we wait for Skavik to make his next move, perhaps we could play a little Sabak? I saw that one coming. Or so, don't be such a spoil sport. What do you say, Captain? First game's on me. What's the harm in a friendly game of cards? Don't say I didn't warn you, Captain. Get us a round of drinks, won't you, Corso? There's a good man. Let's deal some cards. You win again. That was... very impressive. Impressive? <laughs> the Captain just cleaned your chrono, Darmus. Hmm. I'd say you've played this game before. I just played the cards I was dealt. Played in beginner's luck? I'm not sure if that's better or worse. Hold on. I'm receiving an alert from my network. This may be what we've been waiting for. Looks like your efforts have paid off, Captain. My informants just witnessed Skavik fighting someone and fleeing into Justicar's territory. We have him. Tell me where I'm going, Darmus. You're headed into one of the most dangerous parts of Coruscant. The Justicars don't tolerate outsiders in their sector. Skavik must truly be desperate to risk his life going there. I'm not letting some Justicar kill Skavik before I do. Then you'd better hurry. Justicars aren't known for their mercy. My informants are a brother and sister named Jick and Jewel. They know where to find Skavik. I'll tell them you're coming. Play your hand carefully in the Justicar sector. My instincts tell me Skavik hasn't shown all his cards yet. Don't worry. Nothing's gonna stop me. Good luck to you, Captain. I hope you make Skavik pay all his debts. The Captain, right? About time you got here. Thanks to you, the Justicar snagged my brother Jick. Should've never tangled ourselves in your cloudhead business. Kid, I have no idea what you're talking about. Typical cloudhead. Don't know which way is up unless the turfer explains it. Listen hard and wise up. I'm Jewel. My brother Jick and I were watching Skavik for you. Big mistake. Nothing but trouble. Things always go bad for turfers when cloudheads come down here. Never should have took this job. Plenty of other ways to earn a living, kid. What do you know? You live in the clouds. You don't know anything about turfer land. Jick and I were tailing Skavik when the Justicars came after us. Jake stuck to Skavik, I drew the Justicars. I lost those helmet brains easy, but they snagged Jake and hauled him off to their detention center. Why would the Justicars arrest your brother? I don't know. Those locksteppers make up the rules as they go. Jake knows where Skavik went, but he didn't have time to spill it to me before they snagged him. You want Skavik? Better prowl into the Justicars detention center and free my brother. Jailbreaks aren't exactly easy, kid. Like I don't know that? But listen. I got an idea how to do it. Once inside the detention center, you have to bash all the Justicar droid eyes. That's how they track intruders. If those droid eyes aren't rubble, the Justicars will know your face. You don't want that. Those idiots want my face on file? They're welcome to it. You want a price on your head? Fine. But Jick's in enough trouble. I don't want the Justicars coming after him again. Don't just stand there goggling at me. Get Jick out of that detention center before something happens to him. I've been meaning to get some exercise. Take this hollow transmitter with you. I want to talk to Jake as soon as you free him. I take it you met the Justicars. Did you at least manage to wound him? The Justicars are a bunch of crazy vigilantes. Might as well spring the little fellow while we're here. Don't worry, I won't leave you in there.
เมหูเกตาแจวูปาหากาแคชูหินชูชิบุกว่าว่านังซิโกมาฮาระเซควาฮาบุอยากเข้าองบาฮาบัวทุกขาฟาแดได้ดีมุ่งข่าวว่าสาวบอกคุยได้คุยมโยยาฟาเดียไปไหนไปไหนไปเฮ้ยซิสนิวยูวุ่นฟอร์เกตอะบอกมีคุณคือคลาวด์เฮดคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุณคุ What with the beatings and torture, Skavik and the Imperials were laughing about something. I'm not sure what. The Imperials took Skavik into the works. The works, huh? Then that's where I'm going to. Are you crazy, Cloudhead? That place is like instant death. If Skavik dropped to the works, you may as well go home. You wouldn't last five minutes. We're pretty good. Bet we last ten minutes. The works is nothing but toxic runes and berserk droids. People who go down there don't come back. If Skavik and the Imperials can survive down there, so can I. You're a lot braver than I thought, or dumber. I'd like to go home now. This is the worst party I've ever been to. Jack, remember the tunnel we found? Crawl in and come to the warehouse. I'll hide you from the Justicers. Great. I'm gonna smell like rancor droppings for a week. Thanks for busting me out, Captain. You did good, kid. Kid, I'm almost as old as you. Jick, take my hollow transmitter from the captain before you leave. I'm not letting you out of my sight. Don't be so dramatic. It's only a little torture. Good luck down in the works, Captain. You'll need it. The Marusta Van Ruby. It's even more exquisite than I imagined. This will be the perfect centerpiece for my gift to the Grand Moth. Sure, to learn you a nice fad promotion. Maybe the Grand Moth will finally let you go home to Droman Cars. Watch your tone, Skavak. My agent is standing by at the spaceport, ready to deliver the item. Do you have someone ready to receive it? There's a twitchy little starship merchant named Fabazan in my docking bay. He'll accept my payment. Lieutenant, transmit the signal. I don't know what you want with that grotesque trophy, Skavak, but it's all yours now. Need any other priceless relics, Commander? Just let me know. Where's my ship, Skavak? Captain, seriously, I admire your persistence, but this is ridiculous. How do you know this man, Skavak? He's an acquaintance who just can't take a joke. You're gonna be a floor stain when we're done with you, Skavak. Or so. I heard about your job. Hey, don't let unemployment make you bitter, all right? You're the one who followed up my identity record and sent half the galaxy chasing me. That wasn't very nice, Captain. It's the least I could do for you, old pal. You know, holding on to anger like that will give you health problems. Is it necessary to tell every woman in the civilized galaxy I have bought the Nether Rod? <sighs> That's just low. Enough. The captain is your problem, Skavak. Deal with it. Commander, would you mind vaporizing the captain for me? I've got places to be. Skavak, blast that scoundrel! Always leaving me to clean up his messes. You could just let me go. No, and I'm afraid you won't be leaving here. We'll give you a very nice unmarked grave. Sigo maharaze kwa habu yakamu ba kwa ba tu kafara dai. Who do you think you are giving me orders? You're as good as dead, you alien filth. Boy, am I happy to see you. Me who get a jet up a haka ke chu hin chu chi bu ko wa nang. Ta ke to ka ko wa ta jet la wa ka ne he ko ba he ko ha sama ne ko ha me. Spare me your false heroics. Men, kill this alien scum. Yeah. 
We'll get you to a Colto tank. Why are you going to say now? We hey major. Not have had that bandala. Yaku eta na dene. Poor little guy. He didn't deserve to go out like this. We see what I okay dene. Jeez, Kakava Coyota. Do banda baka wonky. Three words, pal. Where's my ship? Look at the young bee that one any bogo or chopper do, huh? The bees can cook up on me, what? But then you know, you're the porta. Do what do you must, uh, or grandly tempo to monkey donka. Now you're ugly and dead. Ujimo, open corn, I'll be easty, but donka. For the last time, where's my starship? It's going to be top part. Bombo Gita Kun Bosca Bulya? Jessica Koli Raka Kanchanga? Bomba Kunchinka? Not yet. But you owe the captain something for all his trouble. What room at the water done we want to you at Oba Jakamuka? What are my options? You know, he's kitchen under what you'd cause, but any continga. Cantabata Chawa, Wermo, Mukilima Wahota. Fui Baniaka Tweepy, Taboka Tonka, Wana Waka. Die, you little creep. Juba Umbongo, Chino Wadada. Taking a wild guess that my life just got a new kind of complicated. Honey, I don't remember leaving a beautiful woman in my cargo hold. Must be my lucky day. Depends on your definition of lucky. My name's Risha. I've been traveling with Skavik as part of a business arrangement. He and I had a deal to deliver the things you see here. Skavik isn't known for honoring his deals. Then maybe my luck is about to change. Skavik was going to deliver this cargo, but he's proving unreliable. I think you might be a much better partner. Let's hear your offer and we'll see. My offer is simple. I make you filthy rich. It's a pretty straightforward business model. What do you know? That's Skavik on the ship's hollow. This should be an interesting conversation. You're late, Skavik. And I just made a new friend. I think you two will loathe each other. Congratulations, Captain. You're officially number one on my list of people to kill. When I get my hands on you, you'll wish you'd never left, Lord Mantell. Can't kill what you can't catch, Skavik, and you don't have a ship. Well, there's plenty of ships to steal in Coruscant. I'm sure I'll find something fast and deadly. Don't know how you got away from those Imperials, but next time, I'll kill you myself. Assuming Rogan the Butcher doesn't get you first. I sold all those blasters you were supposed to deliver for him on Lord Mantell. I can't imagine he'll be happy that you lost them. I'll make sure Rogan hears who really fouled things up for him. I'm sure you'll have lots to say while Rogan tortures you to death. Are you done posturing, Skavik? The captain and I have cargo to deliver. Don't even think about cutting me out of this deal, Risha. Finders keepers. Isn't that what you always say? 
Not my fault the captain here beat you to the big prize. Sweetheart, you two just made the biggest mistake of your lives. Thought that blowhard would never switch off. So, we were discussing how I can make you fabulously wealthy. The items here are pieces to a key. A key that unlocks the lost treasure of a very rich dead man named Nock Drayen. Now you're speaking my language. Just wait. It gets better. Nock Drayen was the greatest gangster who ever lived. He personally wiped out the Wrath Cartel and the Vandal Helm Combine during the Syndicate Wars. When he died ten years ago, Nock had more wealth than some Outer Rim worlds. Even the Huts were jealous. What happened to Nock's fortune after he died? Now we're getting to the interesting part. Nock hid his fortune right before he died. For ten years, treasure hunters across the galaxy have searched for it, in vain. Until now. You see, I've finally figured out how to get the lost riches of Nock Drayen. You're my new best friend, Risha. That's sweet. But let's try to keep this professional for now. Whoever gets Nock's riches will become an underworld legend. Skavik had his chance and blew it. Now it's your turn. Help me deliver these things in your cargo hold, and Nock Drayen's wealth will be all yours. What are you getting out of this? I'm after something personal. The money doesn't mean anything to me, Captain. I'm the only one that can help you trade these items to get Nock Drayen's treasure. But I won't tell you everything up front. To get the riches, you trust me the same way I trust you. One step at a time. Deal? We'll see if this treasure hunt of yours is worth it. Once you get a taste of this job, I think you'll be hooked. We have deals set up on Taris and Narshada. I'll make all the arrangements and introductions for you on both planets. Until then, I'll be in my bunk. That caged beast there isn't much good for conversation, so come visit me if you feel like chatting. I'll be around for anything you need, sweetheart. Anything. That's a comfort. Looking forward to working with you, Captain.